<laughs> I, uh, I've been practicing my superpowers lately. I'm gonna rewind that a bit. If evolution and Marvel comic books have taught me anything, is that we will soon have real superheroes. And I will be the first one on this bandwagon when it comes around. Oh my god. I shall be Captain Neurosis. <laughs> Master of paranoia, able to incite anxiety attacks in one fell swoop. Oh my god. It'll be awesome. My costume, I'm not, I'm not thinking I'm gonna be too cool looking. Uh, just kind of going for a lot of layers of Under Armour, oh some bicycle equipment, oh my maybe some sweats. I don't want to be cool when fighting crime, I want to be cozy. So, I want to take a nap after I thwart evil. My bad guy, my super, I think my arch nemesis wouldn't really be like a take over the world type guy as much as he would be just a douchebag. Oh just some frat boy named AJ. <laughs> AJ and I would do battle on college campuses everywhere. I'd be trying to thwart his never-ending stream of peer pressure. I kind of tried to plan for what our battle would look like. Um, my first move, after initially, after initially uh, combat rolling out of my Fort Focus, just... Oh my gosh. <laughs> Safety first, right? <laughs> and then our battle begins. I would actually, he'd initiate with something, and then I'd reply by just finding someone and just kind of staring at them for a while. <laughs> <laughs> and then I'd go, have, go ahead and give him a fact about my body. <laughs> my stomach gurgled this morning. <laughs> I checked web and I checked web MD. Could be hunger. I think it's a tapeworm. <laughs> and then I just kind of creep back. <laughs> And that'd be the first attack. <laughs> He'd go off and fill up a cup of like punch with alcohol on it and throw it at me, probably. Uh, so my reply to that would be to just defend myself and revert back into some kind of chrysalis state, just to protect my vital organs. Oh I can't do it right now, <laughs> but it'd be awesome. <laughs> and finally, my finishing move uh, would be a little something I call the clever girl. There are a few of you in there that know what's coming up. Uh, the clever girl, which is something, to preface this, I've actually done this in public before. It's, it's kind of become my official uh, distress call among my friends. Um, for those of you who didn't catch it, that was a Jurassic Park reference. The clever girl is when I begin acting like a velociraptor to make people go away. Oh my God. <laughs> and I, like I said, I've done this in public, and my friends will see that I'm having issues with a crowd of people oh. like this, and then... <laughs> <laughs> Thanks to Nikki. Thank you so much. Ah!